Yo, 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 it's your boy Gabe. We're back again with another video. What's up my athletes, it's your boy Gabe, we're back again with another video and today we're going to be talking about this protein bar uh, created by Gatorade and we're going to be talking about if, you know, whether it's best for weight loss or whether it's best for weight gain. If you haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe, hit that subscribe button, make sure you guys drop a like and make sure you guys follow me on Instagram, it's one underscore more 97 and follow the apparel page, that's om97 underscore apparel and uh, as you can see, the merch is up, website is up. Um, a couple people you know, bought some stuff. I wanna say thank you to all you guys who made your orders and stuff like that. I appreciate you. I got some new drip coming soon. All right, I got some t-shirts and I got some uh, other hoodies coming out. And uh, they're pretty dope, I love the design. But um, let's get back to the video. Let's start off with the calories, okay? The calories on this is 350 calories. Um, it has 13 grams of fat, all right? It has 10 grams of saturated fat. Saturated fat is not good for you, okay? It's not. It has 41 grams of carbs. It has uh, two grams of dietary fiber. It has a total of 29 grams of sugar. That's a lot of sugar. With the added sugars, there's uh, 28 grams, and it has 20 grams of protein. I'm gonna be honest, for 350 calories, if I'm gonna eat a protein bar that's, that, that has that much calories, that's this small, for 350 calories, come on, you, you can do better with the protein. I'm gonna be honest, I'm gonna to have to go with uh, weight gain. If you are looking to gain weight, this is the best protein because um, it gives you the saturated fat that you can work with if you wanna build some muscle. Um, it definitely gives you the calories and you're most likely going to feel hungry after you eat this. So you'll probably eat on top of that. It does have a good amount of protein and uh, everything else that it has could just factor into you gaining weight as long as you eat calories. Uh, but I'm definitely gonna go with weight gain on this. Um, if you're looking to lose weight, I'm gonna be honest, during my weight loss, um, here and there, if you know, if I was hungry, I would, uh, I would eat one of these if I had to, but I would have to uh, factor in the 350 calories to my caloric deficit, all right? And I ate under, the max that I ate during my weight loss journey was uh, 1,500 calories. So I have to factor this in, I have to factor the saturated fat in, and the protein in and i'm going to drop a video soon about uh my next goal my next uh, body goal my next weight goal so stay tuned for that but as far as this video goes guys um if you are looking to gain weight all right if you're looking to build some muscle i would definitely go with this just because of the calories the calories are so high and the bars uh, it's not it's not it's not a big meal so you'll still be hungry after this and you'll still you know you'll tend to eat something else after this and uh, remember, if you're looking to gain weight, you got to increase your caloric intake. You got to eat more, but it has to be clean. All right. No fast food. Stick to the clean stuff. That's basically it for this video. I'm going to um, definitely leave the link in the description below for this protein. If any of you guys are trying to gain weight, put on some muscle mass. But uh, as far as uh, as far as the weight loss people go, I would stay away from this. OK, just because of the saturated fat. The high in calories and you know you might still being hungry after this so uh that'll be it for this video all right make sure you guys like and subscribe i hope you guys um found this video useful and make sure you guys stay tuned for more videos to drop and yep that'll be it we out